Now I see through a glass darkly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then I shall know just as I also am known. Eternal Lord of glory, how good you are. The gifts you give my little hands can't hold, and so they overflow. And yet, if you can use my open hands to hold your treasure dear, if you can use my life laid down to lift her to you near, if you can use the burning light of love I can't keep in to cause her face to rise, to shine, to keep on fighting and finally win, then I shall be satisfied. My Lord, my God, my guidance, wisdom, strength, my joy and song, gentle shepherd of my soul, how can I say thank you for your unfailing faithfulness and for mercy poured out and for the gift of yourself given so many times through the life of my beloved. How can we say thank you for mountains and valleys and laughter and tears and prayers and miles and miles of miracles? I don't think we can. Vanessa Joy Ford, beautiful, bestest ever friend and companion, calm confidant, sharer of tears, sharer of even more laughter, lover of my people and grace of God to me. Arise, my love, my beautiful one. Here I give you my life. For better or worse, richer or poorer, in sickness or in health, I'm yours. I love you. Thank you for loving me. My beloved, you are to me as an apple tree among the trees of the forest as the lily of the valley and the one altogether lovely. You have won my heart and I will be satisfied in your love and affection all the days of my life. Sean, Aaron, Adrian, Neblet, I am yours forever and always. I love you.
And yet, if you can use our little flame to melt some ice somewhere, if from our corner your great name can rise on wings of prayer, if you can take our battered best and bless and break and give so that some dying, starving one somewhere can lift their eyes and live, then we shall be satisfied.